<laughs> I'm here with William Zimmerman. We are at the Music Medic booth. William, what did you just buy, man? I just bought a Trevor James uh, custom bra, signature bra. A, a, a Trevor James custom. It's a gorgeous tenor. And now, it's brand new. We're gonna unbox the Trevor James Let's do it. right here. And we're gonna get a setup with Keely. Check this out. I'm just gonna bring the bell up here. I'm gonna show you this. So you just bring it up there. Now, key leaves, leave keys open to dry clean. It's a really simple concept. And all you're gonna do is you're just gonna rotate this however you need for your, your particular horn. So on this case, he has, Trevor James has some really great double key arms on the low C sharp. So for this, you can just wrap it around the contour of the sax, lift up that C sharp, bring it down there, and now that is safely open to dry without touching leather. And because this one is linked to G sharp, G sharp is now open, and G sharp doesn't stick. Because this one usually sticks, it has light spring tension, but when you open the low C sharp, that one's open to dry clean. And this is safe on any finish, especially one as beautiful as this, raw brass, silver, bronze, anything. So you just, you just slide it under the C sharp arm, and that may be different depending on your key arm. We have all kinds of videos online, and we're about to put this video online. And then you can bring it around here, because we're gonna get the gutter pad, or the sewer pad, the E flat. We're gonna prop that one open. So you can rotate it however you want. And maybe for this one, you could just bring it up and arch it under there. And there you go, it's not touching the leather at all. And that's open to breathe air, dry clean. And what that does, people ask us like, well, what does that do? The bacteria, when it's dark and wet, gets sticky. It gets funky and sticky. And then you blow it all through the horn. That's why all your keys stick. So if you air out the body of the horn as much as possible, that, that does not happen. And so, so just by doing this, he's airing out three keys. Now we're going slow for demo. So William, pay attention, because this is going to be your job when you get home. You're just going to take it. You can even do this with one hand. Boom. Boom. I think that was four seconds. We weren't timing officially, but it's easy. It's easy. You can do this on a set break. You can do this between, between gigs. You put it in the case. Now let's show you how it works in the case, okay? Because we get a lot of questions about that. And this is a brand new Trevor James case. It's a professional flight uh, uh, contour case. So this is great. So check this out. Just set that down in there, William. No fuss, no muss. This is just a flexible strap. Doesn't hurt anything. And this is out of the way of everything. And the case comes down. And if it, in some cases, will touch this. This one doesn't. It holds it nice right on the belt. But it just closes and you're fine. Not even touching that C sharp, right? No problem whatsoever. No problem in cases. It's safe. And we also get questions like, is this gonna bend my keys? Is it gonna, is it gonna bend my keys, right? Check this out, get real close up. Now this is a double key arm. This is extra strong key arm. So we're really putting, we are really putting some, you know, some reinforcement on this key arm. Check out how much it squishes. Just a light touch and even a hard touch squishes and it gives. So, so you know, it's safe, man. We, we've field tested this for over a year. They are really safe, they work, and you can trust them to keep your horn playing great. So that's, uh, that's key leaves. It leaves keys open to dry and it stops sticky keys and pad rock. You can find us at keyleaves.com. And now, William, the bottom of your horn and the G sharp is not gonna stick. Right. You're set, right? Yeah, I've been dealing with yeah. it for years. Yeah, and next, yeah. next, He's got these new pads with these delicate, delicate, nice, new, clean, fresh pads. Look at that. Can you see that nice new leather? It's soft, it's supple. You wanna keep it that way. You wanna keep these keys nice and clean. So that's where you get the vent bind. And so we're gonna, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna show you a vent bind next. We're gonna have to pause and make him a custom fit vent bind, but stay tuned. We're gonna do that for William. We'll be right back.